Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hi, this is Ghufran. In this video, you will learn how to make a maze game in Scratch 3.0. So let's start it. This is my code area. This is all the available blocks. This is my stage. This is my sprite area. And this is my backdrop area. So I don't need the sprite. So I am removing it on click on the dustbin link. So here I am choosing a backdrop. Upload backdrop from my PC. You can also download this backdrop from the below description link. Okay, I have added a, a maze BG at uh, my, on my uh, scratch, so uh, I also don't need it uh, the backdrop from this. So I am removing it. Okay, so this backdrop has a name that is maze BG. I'm also adding two backdrops for uh, you win and game over. For this, I'm uh, adding another two backdrops that is paint click on paint so here i am giving this a uh, backdrop a name that is you win so okay i am uh, typing here uh, that is you win you win okay click on this and that's great now i am adding another uh, backdrop from here paint I am giving this backdrop a name that is game over I am here click on this T text game over click on select option make it at center center okay so I have added a three backdrop that is maze BG you win and game over so let's start our code so oh, I am adding a uh, choose sprite here I will add a pinging pinging so this is my sprite so whenever I click on this sprite flag click whenever I click on flag so change the backdrop to the change the backdrop to maze bg so whenever I click on flag so it will reset to the maze bg backdrop so the and i also want to reduce the size of this pingin so re reduce the size from here 50 50 is also i need to 35 so i'm uh, i have reduced the sprite size okay good and i'm also uh, fixing uh, this sprite uh, position that is whenever i click on flag so it will go to the position on this x coordinate and y coordinates so whenever i click on flag it will go to this position okay good uh, now i am adding uh, i am checking for this costume it has three costumes this spring gun has three costumes for this i am adding uh, whenever flag click foreverly change this costume next costume and wait wait 0.5 second after 0.5 second this will change its costumes okay you can see it here now okay good now i am adding uh, a backdrop that is whenever i click on the up arrow it will move into the up direction whenever i click on the down arrow it will move to the down direction uh, so and so on so for this I will add a forever block and if condition and sensing click on sensing whenever I press the up arrow so it will change the Y position to change Y position by minus 5 so let's try it sorry change position by 5 yes you can see it it's moving to the up position that's good now take a duplicate from this blocks for the down arrow so whenever i press on the down arrow so it will change its position to change y by minus 5 you can see it here whenever i press on the up arrow it changes position to up position now same is the case for the, uh, the right and left button so whenever I click on right arrow, it will change the change x by 5. 
and whenever I click on the left arrow it will change the X position to minus 5 so let's try it as you can see it it's moving smoothly moving I'm also adding a block that is a uh, point in direction whenever I click on right arrow so it will point in direction 90 degree whenever I click on left arrow it will point direction into minus 90 degree as you can see it and here I can also add a set rotation style into left right on the top set rotation style left right okay so I have uh, add a blocks for this movement so whenever I'm pressing the up arrow right arrow it's moving smoothly okay that's good now I am adding uh, another check that is uh, whenever I whenever this price touches this black line it will change the backdrop to the game over so for this I will add here whenever I flag click foreverly checked foreverly checked if if this sprite touches this black line so it will change the backdrop to game over and the game will stop so click on sensing block and click on touching color whenever this sprite touches this black color so click on this question mark click on this and choose this black color okay good whenever this uh, sprite touches this black line so change this backdrop to the game over background so let's try it that's good okay let's play this game and whenever i touches this that's good well done okay and uh, we can also add a sound uh, so you can also add sound that is start sound pop you can also change the sounds from the sound step okay now uh, i have added a game over option now i'm adding another sprites that is the ping and babies which uh, will be the position at this point so for this i will adding a choose a sprite option and i am pinging so this is a ping in two okay so this is a ping in two so i am reducing its size to the 20 20 or 30 so okay good whenever i click so now i'm adding a blocks to this sprite penguin 2 whenever i click on flag so it's i am setting his position to the go to 210 and y minus 159 whenever i someone has changed its position but whenever i click on flag so both the sprites goes it's to the original positions okay that's good now i am adding uh, another block that is uh, another check whenever this sprite comes to this uh, uh, ping in 2 and touches this ping in 2 the the backdrop will change to the u win block u win backdrop so for this i am adding a whenever flag clicked forever block foreverly check check what if if this sprite ping and touches this ping and two so this is block at the sensing option touching drag this block into this position whenever this ping gun touches this block this sprite so so check from this ping and two so change uh, the backdrop to the u win okay good now let's play in the game okay sorry uh, whenever this backdrop comes to this position and I am as you can see it this the the ping gun and the ping gun 2 touches the backdrop and the backdrop has been changed to the UN backdrop you can also add a sound a foreverly sound at the background whenever flag kick foreverly play sound at the sound block play sound here is only one sound that is pop 
you can add sound from there sound position choose a sound and uh, here all the available sound you can see it you can add it from here x y l o 2 that's good okay now let's play again that's good that's great well done so uh, this is the all the game uh, i hope you like this video and please subscribe my uh, channel for more informative videos thank you so much